you know, it's a it's a tough time, isn't it? You know, I, I know for a fact that there's a lot of uh, guys on the right, Peter King, for instance, and people like that, who uh, who are also doing the best they can to, to stop this from happening or to put an end to it. And I think cooler heads are going to have to prevail, and I think they probably will. They usually do. They usually have. And you just hope it happens soon. Yeah, it's Looney Tunes and not Merry Melodies. That's how I feel. Being from Canada and having public health care and it being awesome and when you first and look I love the states I live here awesome awesome um, and the fact that this is all about Obamacare just seems it seems insane to me I think it's shameful honestly and I think they should give up their salaries as well <laughs> I have no idea I've literally been thinking about it all week just like I honestly don't know. I mean, it's so huge and it's so crazy and it's so scandalous and like, what the heck? I don't know. If anything, I don't understand why the health care that's being offered isn't more leaning towards universal and single payer. You know, when you come from a country where it's just sort of a right that you grow up with, it's a little bit mind boggling when you learn about the health insurance system, to be honest with you. It's extraordinary. I, I only found out from my executive this just for lunch. I had a little chat with them. They went, oh, the government shut down. I went, when do they need me? I'm ready, Obama. I'm stepping up. <laughs> you vote for me.